For more videos, visit forthesakeofeducation.com. All right, guys, now we're going to do this problem that says the ball D has a mass of 20 kilograms. If a force F of 100 newtons is to pull this uh, ring at A to the right, then determine the dimension D right here so that the force in AC is zero. So this doesn't exist. So you know that sum of the forces in the X is equal to zero. So minus AC cosine of whatever angle it forms, X squared is theta, is going to be zero minus AB cosine of phi and I'm calling this angle right here phi plus 100 is equal to 0 so AB cosine of phi is equal to 100 got one equation right here so some of the forces in the Y is equal to 0 so you know that AB sine of phi minus now you know that this thing has a mass of 20 kilograms therefore it has a weight of 20 kilograms times 9.81 which is the acceleration of gravity which would make this 196.2 newtons so the sum of the forces in the y is the y component of this AB force minus 196.2 is equal to zero so AB sine of phi is equal to 196.2 so let's call this 1 let's call this 2 you divide 2 by equation 1 and you get AB sine of phi over AB cosine of phi is equal to 196.2 over 100 so AB cancels out sine of phi over cosine of phi is tangent of phi and this is equal to 1.962 so when you solve for phi you get that phi is equal to 63 degrees now <coughs> in this triangle right here this triangle right here You got phi, you know that this is 2, given right here, and you know that this is, let's call it h. So you know that tangent of phi, which we have, is equal to opposite over adjacent. So that height is equal to 2 tangent of phi, phi we got a 63, so, and remember that h is equal to d plus 1.5 so we got phi when you plug in phi from right here and you solve for d you're gonna get that d is equal to 2.424 that is in meters final answer Please comment below if you want me to do any problems and I'll be happy to help. Thank you.